They're back. Those worms that create webs in our trees are making a comeback this summer. There is a way to keep them from getting out of control, though. Tonight, our rogue gardener shows us how. Many of you will remember last year we had a terrible infestation in the valley of fall webworm. The bad news is they're back. Here is the typical start of the fall webworm damage. You can see these unaffected leaves, and here you can see the webbing that is produced by these caterpillars as they actually enshroud the leaves, feed on the underside, and the webs continue to grow as more and more insects become present. Now here we can see just the very start. These caterpillars are crawling around and are just beginning to feed and to build a web. So we're in the very early stages. There are a couple of products that are effective against the fall webworm. This particular one is Spinosad, and you can also use Bacillus thuringiensis, which is specific only to caterpillars and won't harm anything else. Or you can just choose to cut off the affected foliage, put it in a plastic bag, send it off to the dump. Whichever way you choose to attack these critters, make sure that you get the job done early. It's much easier while the infestation is light. This is Stan Mapolsky, The Rogue Gardener.